you watching africa mogo my name is amatricia so tom hoodies is still selling and the customers watching who've already gotten this please leave your comments how was the service for you was it great just tell us leave your comments give us feedback so we know and upgrade our service just for you and you can check our youtube status if you've not gotten one there's this beautiful colors and brands new hoodies in just check it out and order one for yourself now, Sao Korea and his family were in quarantine for 14 days after they arrived in the country. And we're all praying that they should finally get out of it because we're in hurry to, you know, get something from Sao Korea. And his wife, Tracy, came out to talk about the whole quarantine and how they've been kept in their home and they were unhappy about it. But God being good, now they are done with their 14 days quarantine and they are out. So we saw a video of Sarkodie in a car in his face max and was jamming to his Zab Zero. The man is happy. He is finally a free man out of all this quarantine and all of that. Talking about Sarkodie listening to his Zab Zero song which was a diss song to some particular artist here in Ghana. And in a line you could hear him say Makoko be my boys And now he's back and he's still listening to the song. Sakori, said I leave that to rest. Still talking about Sakori. Sakori's personal DJ, DJ Mensa, has come out to say that in 2012 in Kumasi, Sakori had a spiritual attack before his performance. Now, this is what he wrote. Show back to 2012, I had the sickest playlist that could let the crowd go crazy for two straight hours with no hype man. Down to 2020, you can still hear some DJs using same playlist, mixing to a point the crowd could easily tell what track is coming after. No shade. Oh, ignore the shouting at background. That was my backup hype man, Angel Town Baby. Some people didn't want the show to go on. It was more spiritual than physical. Got on stage as usual. And when news came out that Sarkodie had totally broken down and couldn't even stand. But before he came out, I was totally charged and in charge. Took the intervention of his family and some pastors to pray via phone to get him up on stage. Halfway during the show, my laptop shut down and it took more than 20 minutes to come back. If you were a Mac user, you would understand this is not normal. Just when it came on, speakers went off for a while. As if that wasn't enough, all the stage lights went off leaving just one LED light. That didn't stop us. We serve a living God despite all the challenges. We still give our best. People keep asking for more all the time without even knowing some challenges we face. Sometimes the stories must be told as you all remember us in prayers. This is the life we chose. We are your faithful servants and our job is solely to keep you entertained no matter the situation. Oh, and whoever was behind this attacks was revealed to us by pastor. No, it wasn't an artist. It wasn't Obi Nim nor Nigel Gezi. All I will say is that whoever did that's got nerves in Kennedy Japan's voice. So this is what DJ Mensa had to say. Don't forget to order for your Tom Hoodies, beautiful colors and different brand. Also, we will drop uh, Sao Korea and join his Zab Zero in his car for you. Thanks for watching Africa Mogo. My name is Amma Trisha. Do like the video and also subscribe to the channel for more updates. And the customers who have already gotten their hoodies, don't forget to leave your feedback. Yeah.